Hi, this is Jen Browning in tech service at BASF. Today I wanted to talk to you a little bit about controlling crabgrass, annual grasses, and broadleaf weeds in cool season turf during the summer season. You can use Pilex herbicide to do this in a couple of different ways. You can go after crabgrass, goosegrass, and a variety of broadleaf weeds, first with Pilex alone. So you can use one or up to two applications spaced about three weeks apart, keeping in mind that smaller plants are easier to control. So if you have larger plants or you have more plants, then you'd go out at that two applications. You'd use one to one and a half ounces of Pilex per acre with MSO in the tank. Or your other option, particularly if you're in the West and you have some of those harder to control Western crabgrass biotypes, is you can use a half rate of Pilex with a half rate of Drive Accelerate. And so that would be 0.75 to one ounce per acre of Pilex plus 32 ounces per acre of Drive Accelerate. And that will give you enhanced control at an affordable price. If you'd like to extend the control that you get and avoid crabgrass for the rest of the season, then you can tank mix Pendulum Aquacap right in there and avoid having to make other post-emergent applications for the rest of the summer. So let's take a look at some of the data that informs those recommendations. So what we're looking at here is Pilex applications at the one to two tiller and three to four tiller stage compared to tenacity. And what you see here is that Pilex outperforms tenacity with both treatments being applied twice here. You're getting significantly better control with the one and a half ounce rate of Pilex regardless of the tiller stage. Here you're looking at the two to three tiller stage and you're looking at either a single or sequential applications of Pilex, again compared to tenacity, although this time at 6.5 ounces. Whether you do it once or you do it twice, Pilex is doing a really nice job on that two to three tiller stage crabgrass. Here you're at the five to seven tiller stage, so you're at the larger stage of crabgrass and you're getting similar results. Better control with Pilex in this situation. So this is some data that supports that tank mix recommendation of Pilex and Drive. You see that if you use either of those products alone, you get acceptable control. Pilex is giving you 87% crabgrass control and Drive is giving you 81%. But when you mix them in the tank together, you get 94 or 96% control. And the nice thing about having them in the tank together is that not only is it economical, it does a really nice job on crabgrass, goosegrass, and a variety of broadleaves, but typically it's also going to reduce some of the bleaching that you see 10 to 15 percent on the susceptible grassy weeds that you're controlling. So in terms of the weeds that you do control, you'll be able to pick up goosegrass, the crabgrass that you're going after, as well as ground ivy, clovers, speedwells, Bermuda grass, and also dandelions. One thing I do want you to remember is you won't be able to get plantains or bent grass and also yellow nut sedge won't be controlled. So take a look at those labels, get familiar with those, reach out to your BASF sales rep or give me a call. I'd be happy to walk through those with you and enjoy a nice crabgrass free summer.